All right, we've got Nordic Innovative. Saxony Engineering. Nordic Innovative. And Rusviet Mechanical. Oh my goodness. The guy playing Rusviet Mechanical is really good too. I'm kind of trying to think about this. The only way this game lasts long enough for me to beat Rusviet is if Rusviet can't get combats, which is largely out of my control. Oh, this isn't going to work because I can only make my mech one cheaper. So, after this I can get another upgrade, do the bolster and I guess the enlist. That's what we're going to do. Is we're going to get max, we're going to, we're going to go eight workers. No, we can't go eight workers because it's deploy and list. First mag next turn, which is slow.
Hmm. Okay. Let's go eight workers and see what happens. So what we're gonna do is next turn we're gonna trade for an oil and a metal. Okay. That's gonna do two things. One, it's gonna allow us to produce, get to those magic eight workers, and get our second mech, so we get a bottom row action there. And then we can immediately trade for two oil to get another upgrade and make our enlist cost only one food. Then we can spread out to these two spots and with seven workers catch one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. And when one produce, we'll have enough for three more mechs. Four enlists. It's just so darn slow. But all we need are going to need is two more mechs. And after we do that, we take our resources and we jump onto water. And we start spreading out. Rusfield built a monument. So he's going to care about his popularity. Glad the game reminds me of that. I always forget. Wonder if we're winning. Yeah, we're winning. <laughs> ah, I just can't keep up with this rust board. So let's rethink this. What if we don't do the upgrade? Then we need eight food. the upgrade. Hopefully we get food off the upgrade, that's what we need. And we're gonna go produce list. been eight otherwise and we don't have eight workers on that village. So now we're just hoping that we can get food out of this encounter so that we can get in the list next turn. So that's gonna bump us up one turn faster and we need every turn right now. Because, yeah, Rusty, it's already up to 29. Probably going to hit tier 2. Oh, yeah, he's definitely going to hit tier 2. He's going 5 workers. But he won't be as inclined to bump the workers. Thank you. 
I'm gonna move. I'm gonna go here. Give me food. That'll play. We have good combat cards, that's for sure. Massive produce. Gonna go factory next. Next turn. We really need a card with a bottom row action. Because I don't know that we can get two combats in this game. But we've caught back up. How many points do we have off resources? Only three? Because we spread out a little bit, I guess. We got the two stars. Alright. Factory. That doesn't do us any good because we need bottom row actions, not... That would speed up our list, but it doesn't change. We have no popularity, we can't use that one. We need three upgrades or four buildings. Gonna get two popularity off. Oh. Off the enlist. I gotta go with this one.
ahead now. The trick is to stay that way. You can get to get some more stars. So what are our stars going to be? Mech, obviously, in list. Already got our objective. Already got our workers. So we need two combats or a combat and an upgrade. Sax only has two. And I have artillery, don't I? No, I don't have artillery. And he just bolstered. That was a nice thought. Saxony right there. He's probably not. Anticipating that I go through there. Character here. The Canada Rasfid if that ever becomes a good option, which is unlikely. Move this guy down here. Do we have a river walk? We do have a river walk, so he can attack me. Saxony looks like he's going to be getting ready to enlist. Okay, Rusfia just hit two tier, tier two. I'm still ahead, but barely he starts spreading out and I'm done for. So, it's time to start using this factory card. Okay, I'm gonna use this. 
to use this. And we're going to upgrade this. This and this. need food or metal. Pretty useless encounter on the whole. Eight plus five is thirteen plus three is sixteen. His cards are going to be good because he has nine of them. There are the enlists. Within three. Would have been nice to have something besides food there. I can only use my factory car one more time and I really need to use it twice. Saxony's got all these workers here, and he can't attack me because I'm staying on these lakes. He starts bumping my workers, he loses his popularity. This may be the rare game where it's actually a good idea. Maybe use a turn. Trading for popularity. So what we're going to do is we're going to use the factory card. Oh, this is spreading out. still be ahead of him if we had three more pop. Well, at least he spent three of it. I don't know why he left it behind. Oh, because he was... Doing that, oh frack. Uh. 
He's got somebody there now that Rust can attack. One more mech for a star. Two combats. at 17 really need sacks to build a building here for me oh he's protecting the factory not really that interested in the factory Yes, there it is. Five, six, seven. Read it and weep. <laughs> it's not much. It's not much at all, but it's something. Now what do I do? I guess I'm going to trade here where Rust can't get it. What am I going to trade? Oil, I guess. Yep, oil. I don't know why he's hesitating on attacking there. He's got two pop to give. Picks up a combat star. I guess maybe he's worried that I'll suicide on him, but I can't suicide on him. I can't. I won't be able to afford to lose territory. I literally can't spread out anymore.
We were smart to put it there. Oh well, I can't do that or that, so I'm gonna do this. Five points. The problem is I can't get any more coins. <sighs> I can bump one worker now. It's enough to offset almost one star. Just gonna trade two oil and put it here next time. Either that or I could do the popularity rush. not going to matter. Keep going. I just gave Russ via the game. I can literally have no more territories without buildings. I have 13. It's 8 plus 4 plus 1. Workers.
here's the thing, I knew he could attack me there. But, uh, Sax messed it up. Because he left, I'll show you. He left these guys on this farm, and Rusvia could easily have attacked with a mech, a mech and a worker, thrown three cards. That was it. He had the popularity to give. So that was that. Well, we didn't win. But that's how you force Rusviet to go 20 turns with Innovative. That's Nordic. Not really a fair fight. And we didn't win it, but it was a well-fought game. Against a very good Rusviet player. He bumped a few workers just to juice the score a little bit. <laughs> Until next time.